All right, folks, here's a quick tip for you when your power window switch goes out on your vehicle. You don't want to be one of those fools that has to open their door and place an order at the drive through window. It's just foolish, okay? Don't do that. If you can't afford the switch or don't know how to replace it, uh, here's a quick fix. Because the switch on this one is $135, and I can't really afford it right now, so what I did is I just soldered, soldered some wires to the motor, to the leads coming off the motor, cut those wires, solder the wires to these long leads. Your electric window basically works like a, uh, it's just a polarity motor. You switch the polar polarity and it raises it up, switch it back, or it lowers it down. So all you gotta do is turn the wires one direction or the other. And I'll show you what we got here. This switch right here no longer works. The other switch, everything else works. Just this one right here is out. It controls this window. So soldered up some long leads directly to the motor. Made a little block to hold those terminals there. I'm using a Milwaukee M12 12 volt battery. You can use any tool battery really. Uh, 12 volt, 18 volt, 20 volt. All you got to do is just figure out the direction. I passed the switch all together. I made a block to hold the terminals, make it convenient. Here we go. Down. Switch it. Up. Simple as that. Any battery works. 12 volt, 18 volt, 20 volt. 12 volts a little slower, 20 volts faster.